Good morning, DS106. It's Ron Peter here, a classroom correspondent from Melbourne, Australia, coming to you in a pre-recorded field report from Busan, South Korea. It's Friday the 9th of September, just about 6 a.m. So this time I thought I'd do, uh, try something a little different with a field report, and this time would be a video report, uh, because there's some oral things I want to share with you. But also, there's some visual aspects which I can't share with uh, via audio. I can provide description, but I'd rather show you. So my previous field report is doing some uh, field reporting from uh, just nearby the Guangan Bridge. So that's where I am today, along the Esplanade area. So I'm just going to pan to my left, the left side of your speaker, if you listen to this in audio, or I can show you here. So that's uh, some high-rise apartments in Hyundai. And, and if we just turn around again, there's some more high-rise apartments. And there's the Suyong River, just here, which runs into the East Sea there. Which, if you start that way, you'll run into Japan. So, go back around again, look down the Esplanade, and let's start our tour. It's a little bit different today because I brought my inline skates. My trusty tours. Let's here we go. There's a little wind shear, I apologize. But we'll try and capture the landscape, the buildings, in this field report. Perhaps some sound of urethane on timber, which is pretty cool too. Beach, beach development area is very uh, popular with people to do the morning exercise. Which I agree, it's smooth and quite good. It's amazing, even the public transport works. Like this early in the morning, just on six. There's already services for the people to use. It's great. And uh, everyone's out on their bikes too. Look back. Let's get in there fine. Good boys. So I guess this is the time to call out uh whoop, hang on a sec, navigation people. Watch me there. Just give some thanks to the people who moved out of my way.